To my Sheldon Heights family, to my family, to my friends, we are rich and we are blessed. In this season, we should use this season to focus on how much God has blessed us. I wanted to pause and share why I think and why I proclaim that we are rich and we are blessed. Anybody that's been in my office will see that I have a sign posted above my desk that quotes Psalms 46 and 10 and it says, be still and know that I am God. So in this season of our stillness, we can still count our blessings because we are rich. So in my focus or refocus on my stillness, this has been my thought. First and foremost, number one, to trust God and to leave all the circumstances up to him. We've read that, we hear that, now we believe that, and now we practice that. My second point on how we are rich and how we are blessed is every Sunday morning when I would walk in, Brother Nichols would be in the lobby and he would ask me, Charles, is God still in control? And I would say, yes, Brother Nichols. So thank you, Brother Nichols, because God is truly in control. Number three, it would be a blessing to our soul if we take this time to renew our spirit. We live busy lives. We have a lot of 10 hour, 12 hour days. We always were thankful for those moments where we can get home and relax. Now that we are still, let's use this time to renew our spirit. Renew it in meditation. Renew it in prayer. Re renew it in affirmation. One of my affirmations is whenever I'm going through a difficult season, I always repeat to myself, stay where you are. Keep talking to me. The situation is under control. I'm talking to my father, God. He's telling me, stay where you are. Keep talking to me. I have the situation under control. Another blessing that we can benefit from in this season is time to reconnect. Time to reconnect with God, the Holy Spirit, our physical family, our spouses, our friends, our children, our grand dogs. Um, we can connect virtually. My family, my daughter connected everybody on FaceTime and we spent a, a wonderful hour just laughing and talking near and far, connecting uh, virtually. We connected uh, by Zoom with our Sunday school class on Sunday and we had a wonderful time connecting, sharing, teaching in this season. And finally, uh, one of my favorite scriptures in my spiritual bank Meaning, whenever I need a scripture, I go to one of my, my scriptures, and this is one of my favorites. It is 2 Chronicles 7, and it reads, If my people, who are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray, and seek my face, and turn from their wicked ways, then I will hear from heaven, and will forgive their sin, and will heal their land. God bless all my father's children.